Welcome back, everybody. Uh, I went to my bank today that orders my coins, and they did not come in. So I went around, picked up some nickel boxes. I got three boxes in total. Uh, two are bank wrapped, and then I have this one, which is primarily customer wrapped. I chose to go with this one first. Um, a few of the rolls were marked. 1957 I think one was marked 1941 and it may have been a 1956 something like that uh, so I chose to go with this one maybe we'll have some luck maybe we won't but let's get into it get into bank uh, customer wrap roll number one I'll open this one up I'll bring you back in let me find something all right, this is roll one. I just slid the coins out. It looks like the majority of them are 1922s. I hope that's not a sign of things to come, but gotta check them. We'll look at them, see if I uh, have anything in this roll. Roll two was all 23s. I did check them, I didn't see anything. So if these end up being all new, uh, coins, I won't bring you back in until we find something. Just an update. All right, fingers crossed. See ya if we find something. Roll four was circulated. I pulled aside this 1987 just because it was in decent condition. So I'll check this one against my album. Bring you back in on the next one. All right, roll number 12 is going to give us our first legitimate find, 1942, not silver, out of Philly. This roll looked pretty old. Let's see, this is probably a 64. Oh, no, 1957 out of Denver. Let's see if we have anything else that looks old. This thing's beat up. 62. What's this one? 81. Me in the 80s. All right, I'll finish through this roll. I'll bring you back in if I find anything. Still on roll 12. And the coin right behind the 42 was a 54. I don't know if we saw the mint mark, if there was any out of Philly. All right, let me keep going. All right, the one and only Loomis roll in there gave us a penny for sure. Let's see what we got. Nineteen sixty-three D. Put that one under the scope. Just to see if uh, there's any kind of going on with the mint mark. I'm not seeing anything. All right, well, we got copper. Let me go through this roll. I'll bring you in if I find anything. Roll 18. I just flatten these out. And it looks like we could have silver. Let's take a look at it. I have not looked yet. 1943, that's silver. Out of Philly. So let's take a look, uh, see if we can find any kind of the, any one of the DDOs. Highly unlikely. I don't see anything in the three. And Nothing on the eye. We got silver on the board. Mint mark looks normal. All right, let me finish out this roll. I'll bring you back in if I find anything else. All right, I'm on roll number 19. I see this one here. Which I was hoping it's silver, but let's take a look, because my guess is it's not. 
me in the 80s. 83. Why are they always so dark? All right. Well, let me get back through this roll. Bring you in if we find anything. All right. I just finished up roll 20. As you can see here, roll 26 is marked 1946. So when we get to that roll, I'll bring you in. We'll check the ender. If the ender is old, then I'll set up the uh, tripod and we'll go through it together. All right, let me get into uh, roll 21. I'll bring you back in if there's a find. All right, here's roll 24. Let's see, maybe this is a reused roll. Most of the coins in this box have been brand new, so. And that looks brand new. So I think they were reused. Yeah. And this is what I've been dealing with for most of the hunt. 21. 21s. All right, let me go through this. I'll bring you back in on the next find. Roll 41, we have our next find. 1954, Philly. And I'll finish out this roll. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Well, that does it. 50 rolls hunted. I'd have to say 70 to 80% of those customer wrap rolls were either 2021s, 2022s, or 2023s. But with that said, we did find a silver. We have uh, a copper penny, 1963 out of Denver. In 1942 believe that was a Philly. Two 1954s out of Philly. A 1957 out of Denver. Pulled out a couple of uh, nice coins. Checking, uh, check against my album. And then the uh, winner of the show is the 1943 Philly Silver Nickel. So I do have another two boxes of nickels, so I may uh, marry another box to this video. So, make another box. We'll get into it. Alright, let's just get right into it. Box two. Roll one. Circulated coins. We'll bring you back in on our first find. Roll number five of box number two. We have a 1955. I have not looked yet. Out of Denver. Find number one for box two. Keep hunting this roll. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Roll number six. Looks like we're going to have some foreign in here. Let's see what we got. Oh, it's a, a hold foreign. It's my first, <laughs> excuse me, hold foreign fine. That's cool. I don't know what that 52 means on the back. I don't know if this is the year, 1952, but it's a cool looking coin. The first for me. I'll have to uh, look into this, find out what coin this is, and uh, maybe I'll I'll list it underneath here somewhere. All right, bring you back in on the next find. Roll number ten. We have a 1953. I have not looked yet. It was obverse facing. Out of San Francisco. I'll take it. 
All right, get into this roll and bring you back in on our next find. Roll 12 is going to give us our next find. I did see it already. 1948 out of Philly. Bring you back in on our next find. Roll 13, I think, is going to be our next find. I have not looked. It's a San Francisco Mint. Out of 1948. Some Ring of Death on there. All right, I'll finish out this roll. I'll bring you back in on the next find. Roll 14. And again, I think this is going to be a find, unless it's a 64. Let's see. Out of Denver. 1954. Another one with a ring of death. Some damage in the center there. It looks like an S in the middle there. Let's take a look at that. Oh, just damage. You zoom out. All right, I'll finish out this roll. I'll bring you back in on the next find. Roll 16 is going to give us our next find. It's a 1941 out of Denver. I think I need this one for the book. Well, I'll put this aside on its own. Something's going on at the top of the building there, like a die chip or something, or just some severe damage. Man, that's rough. All right, I'll put this one to the side. Continue on the hunt. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Still on roll 16. This one was reverse facing, so I did see it already. We have a 1958 out of Denver. Continue on this hunt. I'll bring you back in on the next one. Roll number 19. I might have two finds in here right off the bat. Let's check this one. It's a 1960, which is not a find. And then I was thinking maybe this one here. Is it a 39? 1939. Not a Philly. All right, so we got one find. Let me go through this roll, and I'll bring you back in if I find anything else. Roll number 23. We have our next find, which is a 1941 out of Philly. I'll check the rest of this roll, see if we have any other uh, finds. Here we go, in 1946, what's this one? Uh, 1946, out of Philly. I don't think there was anything else I could see. Uh, that's it that I can see um, right off the bat. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Roll number 25, we have our next find. I did already see this one. It's a 1954 out of Philly. I don't see anything jumping out at me left in the roll. Um, but we'll keep going. See if we do find anything. I'll bring you back in. All right, we're on roll 26. And I see something here. The fourth coin in looks kind of rounded well we're going to look at that one together i have no idea what it is but let's see it's the fifth this is the fourth looks like nothing just damage uh 1971 just rolled let's put it under the uh the scope see if it looks like this uh, maybe it was off struck i'm not sure i think it's just damage i can hold it aside see if uh something is off with it but i don't think so all right let me get into this roll 
I'll bring you back if I find anything. All right, we're on roll number 27. I see at least, I think, two finds. I got the 41, and it looks like a 53. Let's see what the 41 is. I got a 41 out of Philly. And the 53 is out of Philly. All right. I'll keep going into this roll. I will bring you back in if I find anything else. All right. Correction. That 53 was out of Denver. All right. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Roll number 28 going to give us a next find in 1940 out of Philly one coin left I'll get into roll number 29 if I find anything else I'll bring you in I actually hold on one second I don't know what that mark is that's just damage all right I'll bring you back on our next find all right I'm on roll 31 I have a Denver minted beat up 1948 and i didn't uh i didn't see anything uh let's check this one with the d on it's probably a 1964 1960 all right if i find anything else in this roll i'll bring you back in for it all right we're on the same roll i got a 1959 out of philly I'll finish up with this roll here and I will bring you back in and when I find something else. Roll number 34, we have our next find. That looks like uh, 1958 out of Denver. I'll take a gander through here and I will bring you back in if I find anything else. All right, we're on the same roll next find is out of philly i did already see it we have a 1949 i'll finish out this roll i don't see anything jumping out at me i'll bring you back in on the next one roll number 35 we have a 1958 out of denver All right, I'll check the rest of this roll. I'll bring you back in if we find anything else. Roll number 36 will give us a 1959. I have not seen the back out of Denver as well. I'll put this one under the scope just to old time's sake. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. All right, put it to the side. Bring it back in on our next find. Roll 47 is going to give us two finds back to back. I did already see the top one. 1955. Out of Denver. And we have a 1958. Also out of Denver. All right, I'll we'll finish in on this roll. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Roll 41, and the last end coin was a 1940 out of Philly. All right, let's get back into it. I'll bring you back in on our next find. Roll 45s, fives, five, gives us our next 50s find. I have not looked at the back yet. Out of Denver. Let's check the mint mark. See, it looks pretty normal. All right. I'll get back into this roll. I'll bring you back in on our next find. All right, everybody. Roll 46 out of box two. And it's about time. We got a buffalo. No mint mark. Barely a date, 20 something here. Looks like a 24. Let's put it under the scope. Um, 
thinking 24. I'm not 100% sure, but I mean, this bridge right here, a four or a six, I don't know. Has all the feathers, all the legs. I'm going to go with four, uh, 24. But we got a buffalo on the board. All right. Continue on to this roll. I'll bring it back in on our next find. Alright, we're on roll 48. <clears throat> I'm seeing this one here. I'm hoping for silver, but probably not. Let's see. Uh, 43. A 43 or a 48. Let's see. I think it's a 48. 1948 out of Philly and did I see I don't know what this one is here all right bring it back in on our next find still on roll 48 and we have a 1957 out of Denver not in bad shape. Let's check it under the scope. Looks like a normal mint mark. All right, I'll bring you back in on our next one. Roll 49. This one just looks old, so let's check it out. We have not old. All right, I'll bring you back in if there's anything here. All right, and that's it for our second box. 50 rolls, 100 rolls total. This one here was at 1971. It looked like it had a rolled edge. I pulled out a few that were just in nice condition to check against my album. And then we had one 1939, two 1940s, two 1941s, a 1946, three 1948s, one 1949, uh, we had a 1941D with that weird, I don't know, looks like damage maybe on the back, we had the 1948S, and we have a 1953 and a 1953s, two 1954s, two 1955s, actually, sorry, three 1954s and three 1955s, one 1957, I think I have four 1958s. Three 1959s. I have a Canadian foreign. This was a Japanese yen, and I'm going to put some info just after this. So hold on. And to end it off, we have the 1924 I believe Buffalo so that does it for our two box hunt we had one silver and a buffalo and then we had a whole bunch of other finds in between all right I'll see you on the next hunt remember to subscribe hit that notification bell and smash that like button. See you on the next one.